Hi, my name is Venus O'Hara and welcome to my sex toy laboratory. In this video, I'm going to be testing Kip from Dame Products. Please forgive me about the noise. I've got this spin cycle going on my washing and I had to do it right now because the daylight is limited and blah, blah, blah. So if you hear some spin cycle going on in the background, it's not a vibrator. Anyway, back to vibrators. Let's talk about Kip. So Kip, on the box it says Kip is a small, easy grip vibe designed for maximum dexterity. Its angled silicon tip is soft enough to flutter while its cupped face delivers all around clit enveloping stimulation. Oh my God, it sounds very intriguing. So that means you can use this tip here to have fluttering, very direct pinpoint clitoral stimulation. Or you could use it flatter on top of the clitoris and have your clitoris enveloped by the deep rumbly vibrations. And of course, you could use this side of the toy if you prefer. So it's actually very versatile. Kip is made from extra soft silicon and it's compatible with water-based lubricant and it's waterproof, so you can enjoy it in the bath or the shower. Kip is presented in this box that also comes with a magnetic USB charging cable, a drawstring storage bag, a Dane Products sticker, and an instructions leaflet. And here you have a picture of how you can hold and use Kip. Now let's see how it works. To charge the toy, stick the cable here and plug it in. While it's charging, the light will flash, and then when it's fully charged, there will be a solid light. And here there are two buttons. This one here is the power button, and to switch the toy on, press down on the power button for a couple of seconds. There are five vibration patterns to enjoy. To change the vibration pattern, short press the power button. Mm and you can increase or decrease the intensity of all of the five vibration patterns. And to do so, press here to increase. Ooh. You can either press down, you can either press down on the button and increase it steadily, or you can short press the button to increase it step by step. Or the other button here at the top, you can decrease the intensity, either by pressing down on the button or short pressing. And then to switch the toy off, press down on the power button for a couple of seconds. As you can hear, maybe, or not hear, it's very, very, very silent. And it feels, mm, wow, deep and rumbly. So this is a very, um, this is a very discreet vibrator. So if you live with your parents or in a shared apartment, this is ideal for you. And I'm thinking that this fluttering tip here would also be ideal for tickling. Let's say the armpits, mm. or maybe the soles of your feet or your nipples. <sighs> Kip also has a travel lock. To activate the travel lock, what you have to do is press down on the power button for 10 seconds. Ten. To deactivate the travel lock, what you have to do is attach the magnetic cable and then plug it in, and then it will be deactivated. So now I'm going to deactivate the travel lock and test it for the first time and I'm so excited. Oh my God, because I've never ever tested anything with this shape before. So wish me luck. May the test begin. experience with Kip. Wow, incredible, incredible. Ooh, so what can, what can I say about Kip? Well, now that I've tried and tested Kip, 
I would say that Kip is like an improved bullet vibrator because most bullet vibrators are just, let's say for me, a little bit pointy. They're quite versatile and stuff, but maybe sometimes they're made out of um, plastic and they're not so soft, whereas this is nice soft silicone. And instead of being completely round, you've got this, uh, this almost triangular shape. So this bit here I found was mm, delicious against my, between my labia. Wow. Um, I tried three ways. I tried this, this way flat on my clitoris, the pointy bit, and this bit between my labia. I prefer indirect clitoral stimulation, so this way of using the toy was the most pleasurable way for me. And to make it even more stimulating, when I was approaching orgasm, I was moving it like this from side to side, and just as I was about to switch the toy off, actually, after the orgasm, I thought, hmm, mm, I'm still kind of horny, so I started moving it again and I had another orgasm, so multi-orgasmic, oh. oh. So I would say this is, um, let's say, an upgraded bullet vibrator. So if you want a bullet vibrator that's discreet, strong, but with softer material and a much more versatile shape, then this is perfect. For more information about Kip from Dame Products, check out the link in the description below. That's all from my sex toy laboratory for today. Thanks for watching.